So I'm right next door here. Are you gonna answer the fucking door? Guess not. Bitch. Okay, go in here. Show these people again. Nope. Can we go, can we go up back? Nope. What the fuck? None of the doors over there are gold. Do we have to talk to the neighbors? What kind of clues have I got? Oh, maybe she. I knew it wasn't safe around here anymore. LAPD, are you acquainted with Celine Henry? Miss Horgan! Jennifer Horgan! What the fuck? I've known Celine for more than 10 years. Our children grew up together. What's going on, officer? Did you see Mrs. Henry go out last night? Well, I'm no busybody, you understand, but... Celine had been drinking. And she and poor, long-suffering Jacob had a terrible row. I think Jacob may have given her a black eye. He stormed out and she went back inside. Did he come back? No. Celine was listening to music and shouting until she left around 10 p.m. She was very drunk to have been driving. But she is not the sort of person you can stop from doing something when her dander is up. What is this about, officer? Is Celine all right? I'm afraid Mrs. Henry has been murdered. Murdered? Oh, my God. I'm afraid I need to go and then sit down. Marital problem. Yeah, like we didn't know that already. <clears throat> Everyone in this fucking game is marital problems. Okay, let's do, let's do this. What are we gonna get that license plate from? The operator. What the fuck was that? You're behind the wheel. Let's see what Jacob has to say for himself. I don't think Jacob is our man, but we should see what he has to say. Jacob Henry had a violent argument with his wife last night. He's looking more and more likely. Uh, for my money, the broad keep the house looking like that, so probably deserve it. Skipper says bring him in. Fuck you. We'll keep the hats on the back. Fine by me. You don't get to hit people all. for that. Good to see you come to the center. I always said work the evidence. I only stipulated a connection to the BD killer as an avenue of investigation we should leave open. And as far as I'm concerned, it still is. You can really, you can really tell that Phelps is a lot more is a lot more intelligent than this guy. Okay, Phelps, so we're going hard. Follow my lead. Why your lead? You Jacob Henry? Yeah. Who's asking? LAPD. You're under arrest for the murder of your wife, Celine Henry. Murder? Celine? Save the dramatics oh, oh my for God. RKO, pal. You got a bigger problem. What the hell are you talking about? You come in here, you tell me that Celine is... Take a seat, Mr. Henry. She's... We're going to have a look around, uh, and we'll talk. 
Jesus, I'm sorry. I... <sighs> okay. I get even the slightest flight of this well. Incidental. What's that? Let me investigate it. What the fuck is this? Do something about my wife. Fuck, it's hard to control. Thanks for the offer. I need to do something about my wife. Interesting, I think I found that, huh? Important clue right there. What do we have here? Size 11. Size 11 shoes. Okay, anything else over here? No, okay, so let's go look. Back here, nothing. I love the, I love the thing of the Oh, what, what was that, a baseball bat? Oh, guess I won't let you investigate it. I love the thing of the doors, because you can instantly tell what doors you can open. So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night? The bar, I suppose. Look, I don't know. This, could that, no, prove it, that I lie. You know where she went, Jacob. You're lying. Why would I help you if you keep lying to me? Look, I'm telling you, I don't know. Okay, I'll see this. Blunt force trauma, missing jewelry. Play to be... Husband's alibi. Female shoe. Forced entry. Are you finished? I'd like some time to grieve for my. What? Why was that? Was a death threat? No. What the fuck? Bullshit. When did you last see your wife, Mister Henry? Last night. I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. I left. And how are we meant to believe that, Jacob? It isn't looking good for you. That nosy bitch from next door, Jenny Horgan. She'll tell you I left. <laughs> and what time? Fuck. I'm doing crap. <clears throat> Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. No, oh, that's a lie. I don't believe you, Jacob. I think you didn't have the guts to do it yourself, so you had someone else do it. You want to back that up with something, Big Mouth? Huh? 
by the phone suggests you meant her harm. You want the truth? The truth is I was sick to death of her. I was trying to have her committed. So you can prove that you came back here after you left your wife's place. I came back here. I was here all night. I work at 6.30. Nothing going out tight. Bullshit. Review notebook. I think you are, asshole. Fino shoe. That is bullshit. You called the bar to give yourself an alibi. Then you went after her, beat her, dumped her in a park. I think you are a sack of shit, Jacob. Ah. Uh. You're not gonna pin Celine's death on me. I'll take a lie detector test to prove it. Show him the lighter. See if this does anything. Fuck! You wanna take all that back, you fresh faced little punk? We're still gonna need you to come downtown, Mr. Harry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. Now you got fed up with your wife, and now you figure kill her who will bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? It was a loss of the trap, and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth! <laughs> so now you're gonna tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jake. Forget how I forget, totally forget how to. Totally forget how to fight. Dodge attacks. Doesn't look good. How do I dodge? Ah, that's all I, that's all I hit. Damn it. Fucking shit. What the fuck, man? Oh, what the fuck? That was bull. Bullshit. Fucking bullshit. 